Welcome to our video on the 5 signs of toxic kidneys. Today we'll be discussing the most common symptoms of kidney toxicity, and how you can identify them. But first, let's start by understanding what the kidneys do. The kidneys are a pair of organs located in the lower back that filter waste products from the blood and excrete them in the form of urine. The kidneys share the function of cleansing the body with the liver. They also help regulate blood pressure and maintain overall fluid balance in the body. Now, when the kidneys become toxic, it means that they are no longer able to function properly. This can be caused by a number of factors, mainly by diabetics but also high blood pressure, chronic kidney diseases, infections, and the use of certain medications. According to a study published in the American Journal of Physiology, the kidney plays a central role in the elimination of toxins and waste products from the body. So, when the kidneys become toxic, it can lead to a buildup of harmful substances in the body. Especially uric acid. If too much uric acid stays in the body, a condition called hyperuricemia will occur. Hyperuricemia can cause crystals of uric acid to form. These crystals can settle in the joints and cause gout, a form of arthritis that can be very painful. They can also settle in the kidneys and form kidney stones. If untreated, high uric acid levels may eventually lead to permanent bone, joint and tissue damage, kidney disease and heart disease. It's super important to recognize the signs of toxic kidneys as quickly as possible. That is also why we decided to prepare this important video. These are the 5 most common signs of toxic kidneys you should be aware of. First. Swelling or puffiness in the legs, ankles, and feet. You've probably seen it in older people that their feet are swollen. When you press the skin with your finger, it stays indented. According to a study published in the Journal of Nephropathology, swelling and puffiness in the legs, ankles, and feet can be a sign of chronic kidney disease and a sign of the accumulation of fluid due to the kidney's inability to properly filter out waste products. Second Symptom Fatigue and Weakness A study published in the American Journal of Kidney Diseases found that fatigue and weakness are common symptoms of chronic kidney disease and can be caused by anemia, which is a lack of red blood cells, due to the kidney's inability to produce the hormone erythropoietin. Therefore, if you have symptoms of anemia, while consuming enough iron in your diet make sure your kidneys are working properly. Third, Nausea and Vomiting According to a study published in the American Journal of Nephrology, nausea and vomiting can be a sign of uremia, which is a condition caused by a buildup of waste products in the blood due to kidney failure. When the kidneys are not functioning properly, they may also not be able to remove enough acid from the body, which can lead to a state called metabolic acidosis. The acidity of your body will be too high which can again cause symptoms such as nausea and vomiting. Symptom number 4. Skin rashes or itchy skin. A study published in the Journal of Dermatology found that skin rashes or itchy skin can be a sign of kidney toxicity and can be caused by a buildup of waste products in the blood. Additionally, chronic kidney disease can lead to mineral imbalances in the body, such as high levels of phosphorus which can affect skin integrity and contribute to skin itchiness. Fifth, Changes in urine color or appearance. According to a study published in the Journal of Urology, Changes in urine color or appearance, such as the presence of blood or protein in the urine, can be a sign of kidney damage or disease. For example, kidneys filter out a substance called urochrome that gives urine its typical yellow color. If the kidneys are not working properly, the urine may appear lighter in color or even clear. Additionally, when the kidneys aren't properly regulating fluid balance, Urine output can decrease resulting in the urine becoming dark and concentrated, this is known as dark amber urine. Another example is a condition called hematuria where there is blood in the urine which can be caused by various underlying conditions including kidney disorders such as glomerulonephritis, kidney stones or kidney cancer. 
It can be in small amount that can only be seen under microscope or large enough to be visible to the naked eye, causing the urine to appear reddish or brownish. In addition to changes in color, kidney dysfunction can also cause changes in the appearance of urine such as foamy or bubbly urine, cloudy urine, or a strong odor. These changes in urine color or appearance can indicate the presence of a kidney problem and should be discussed with a healthcare professional for proper diagnosis and treatment. It's important to note that these symptoms can also be caused by other factors, so it's always best to consult with a healthcare professional if you suspect that you may have toxic kidneys. That's it for our video on the 5 signs of toxic kidneys. If you want to take care of your kidneys in the best way, be sure to watch our next video where we will show you 5 ways to avoid kidney disease and how to stop the progression of the disease if you already have it. Thank you for watching.